In this video, we'll draw the Lewis structure for C4H8O2. And specifically in this video, we're looking at ethyl acetate. So we have a molecular model here to guide us. Then we'll get into the Lewis structure. But we can see from the model a few things. These two carbons right here, this is called the ethyl group. We have a carbon and a carbon and all joined by single bonds. So we have this ethyl group. And then over here, this is what we call the acetate ion. And it comes from acetic acid. So if we look at acetic acid here, we can see it's the same thing. The only difference is we've replaced this hydrogen with an ethyl group. So when we take the hydrogen off, that gives us the acetate ion. We add the ethyl group, we have ethyl acetate. So let's look at the Lewis structure. So here's our Lewis structure. The blacks here, the carbons, they're represented by the C, but also in two lines, they come together like this. We have a carbon here and a carbon here. And then on this carbon, we have one, two hydrogens. So we can draw those in. They aren't normally drawn in. We just assume carbon should have four things bonded to it. And if it's not written, we assume that to be a hydrogen. So now again, we have our ethyl group right here and then our acetate right here. One thing we don't have written in are the lone pairs. So let's add those in. Oxygen, it needs eight valence electrons for an octet. So we'll put those here. That oxygen has an octet. And then this oxygen over here, let's put two more down here, and that'll give this oxygen an octet as well. So we have 36 total valence electrons if you count them up, and now we've used all of them. So at this point, we have our one, two, three, four carbons. We have three plus two, that's five plus three, eight hydrogens, and we have one, two oxygens. And if you count the valence electrons up, they're accurate as well. So this is our Lewis structure for ethyl acetate. So that's it. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure for C4H8O2. We're talking here about ethyl acetate. Thanks for watching.